The Society of Garden Designers offers a full registered membership status in order to maintain professional standards across the garden design industry. I'm working towards becoming a registered member because I know it will give me recognition within the industry. There are many benefits for becoming a member of the Society. You get exclusive use of the SGD logo, which means you can use that on your letterheads, your website, even the side of your vans. And it's that stamp of approval that makes you feel confident, but also gives your clients confidence in your brand. I'm a registered member of the Society of Garden Designers, um, but I also run a registered practice, which enables me and my colleagues to take advantage of the fantastic benefits on offer. Being a registered member uh, of the Society of Garden Designers uh, brings a huge amount of kudos uh, to the business, to me as a designer. Uh, it's one of the most well-respected accreditations in the whole landscape and garden design industry. Another benefit of being a member of the Society is that you can feature on their website. There's a designer search which allows clients to look for designers closest to where they live, or nationally and internationally. To be listed amongst some of the top designers in the country has been really, really humbling. You can also benefit from the Society's PR, marketing, which includes social media, so it's maximising your exposure to potential clients. I have a successful garden design practice based in London and wanted to build my profile nationally and being a registered member really helps me do that. I got an inquiry within a few weeks. Clients have approached me directly through the SDD and the projects they've come with are really, really exciting. Another great benefit of becoming a member is that you can enter the SDD Awards. Now, this is an annual event which recognises the very best within the garden and landscape industry. It's also a really important networking event. The Society is really active in providing support for its members through CPD events such as seminars, which are often close to where you're based, and they can range from supporting you in business to how to detail a construction drawing. There are also two conferences every year, and these feature national and internationally renowned designers. Our membership package also includes the award-winning Garden Design Journal. regular newsletters which keeps you up to date with what's happening within the industry and access to a legal helpline. The Society also takes part in trade shows, for example, the Landscape Show and the RHS Chelsea Flower Show, where registered members have an opportunity to display their work. The pathway to membership is really simple. You can submit three projects in one go or individually and remember that the Society is here to support you. The fully registered adjudication process uh, looks at all of your drawings and project management so it's really helped me to introduce real consistency within um, the service that we offer as a business um, but also looks at the full project management of garden design as well. Your work is assessed by a panel of three highly qualified registered members of the society and they're looking for a high level of professionalism not only in design but also planting, construction and the supporting documentation. The stage submission process for me was brilliant. It meant I could work around my day-to-day -day projects really easily. The adjudication process helped me in a number of ways. The most important being that I now adhere to best practice. I knew I had the body of work, so I decided to submit three projects um, in one go. And when I passed, it was a real sense of endorsement for my practice. Remember that becoming a registered member needn't be daunting. If you're at the right stage of your career, it's simple. If you're already a practicing garden designer, you're ready for adjudication. If you're unsure, then why not join us at one of our adjudication clinics? I decided to go through to adjudication because I want to achieve a high level both in my business and in my work. What I want my clients to have is confidence in my professionalism 
and also what I want is that endorsement from the SGD. Becoming a member of the Society means being endorsed by the only professional association for garden designers in the UK. And of course, we welcome international designers too. So there's an awful lot of garden designers out there in the industry, and it's very much about, for me, taking that step up and about professionalism. It's given me that unique edge so I can stand out from the crowd.